Good evening, sports fans. Before March Madness, there's the February Frenzy. The Georgia High School Association State Basketball Tournament getting into full press mode tonight with first round action. We'll begin out with Region 3 AAA champ Windsor Forest opening up the tourney against Long County. Blue Tide hanging tough in the first half. They're going to pick up the tough deuce in the paint to make it a six-point game, but Windsor Forest able to extend its lead. Ball kicked out to Christian Mobley, who's going to find the twine on the three. Seconds later, Knights in transition. Ball ahead for Region Player of the Year, Zim Fields, who finishes with the one-handed slam. Still more from Windsor Forest off the turnover. Knights bringing it back this way. Mobley going to finish things off with the bucket. Long County would battle, but they're going to come up short. Windsor Forest wins this one, 71-62, the final. Over at Beach now, Bulldogs hosting Brantley County at the doghouse. This one would be a thriller. Brantley County seizing control early. Austin Miller with the steal. He then takes it the other way, drains the triple to end the first quarter. Back come the Bulldogs, though. Tyrese Martin, he's got the baseline jumper that goes. The Herons? They have their stud. How about six foot seven inch Auburn signee Jalen Williams? He's going to slam it down with authority down the other end, and he's fouled. This one continues to be nip and tuck. The defensive pressure. Well, it's going to lead to the steal, and Tyrese Martin going to be there for the bucket. Beach High going to win this one with three free throws in the final second, and they top Brantley County 52. 51 the final stay right there at beach lady bulldogs opening the state tournament against brantley as well beach strong from the get-go kalia rogier with the beautiful look to taylor wilson who collects the easy deuce then it's the bulldogs with the defense jada burgess coming up with the steal she proceeds to collect two more for the home team herons trying to get back into this one molly lee sees a lane wide open she takes it to the rack for the bucket but not nearly enough of that and too much of this. Another steal coming up, followed by another layup from Burgess. Beach Ladies, big 60 to 23, the final. Let's head out to Pembroke now. Bryan County girls hosting Washington County in double A action. It's Washington County keeping things close early. Ashley Gray bangs down the three for the early lead, but the Lady Redskins coming right back. Alicia Easton finds the bank open late on a Friday night from long range. Then the ball going to be uh, get to inside to Jay Black, who's going to put it up and in for the deuce. Now check out Alana Rawls. This young lady can play. Who's uh, watch this losing balance somehow? Ball managed to go through the hoop right there. Yeah, Bryan County moving on to the second round with the 39-31 win. Single A private girl Savannah Christian hosting George Walton. Very low scoring one here. Kayla Jones did her part for the host Raiders. She's got the bucket underneath for Savannah Christian. Then it's Jones again. Almost the same spot. She's got the honors once again. Savannah Christian was starting to pull away in this one. But George Walton going to cut into the lead. Taryn Shellnut, she's got the nice floater in the lane down the other end. The Lady Raiders, though. Kayla Jones using that defense to hold off the visitors. How about the terrific block right here? Savannah Christian moving on to the next round thanks to the 32-26 win over George Walton. 